Electric vehicles are getting a lot of attention lately, but with all the buzz, it's easy to get caught up in some common myths that might make you hesitate to switch from a gas-powered car. Are you wondering if EVs are as eco-friendly as they claim? Do you worry about how long their batteries last or whether they can handle long trips? Maybe you're curious if they're really as expensive as people say. Well, let's clear up all these misconceptions and find out the real truth behind electric vehicles. To know all about this, you have to stay tuned till the end. One of the most persistent myths about EVs is that they are just as polluting as traditional gasoline-powered vehicles. This misconception arises from the fact that electricity, which powers EVs, is often generated from fossil fuels such as coal, oil, and natural gas. However, this is a narrow view of the situation. Unlike internal combustion engine vehicles, electric vehicles do not produce tailpipe emissions. This means that they do not emit harmful gases like carbon dioxide, nitrogen oxides, or particulate matter, which all contribute to air pollution and respiratory diseases. According to the U.S. Environmental Protection Agency, transportation is one of the largest sources of greenhouse gas emissions, accounting for about 29% of total U.S. emissions. By switching to EVs, which have zero tailpipe emissions, we can significantly reduce our carbon footprint. Additionally, while it is true that some of the electricity used to charge EVs comes from fossil fuels, the energy mix is gradually shifting towards renewable sources such as wind, solar, and hydroelectric power. For instance, in 2021, 20% of the electricity in the U.S. was generated from renewable sources, and this percentage is expected to grow as more investments are made in clean energy. Moreover, EV owners have the option to choose green energy plans from their utility providers for the reducing their carbon impact. Consider the case of Norway, where EV adoption is among the highest in the world. In 2020, 54% of all new cars sold in Norway were electric, and the country's electricity grid is almost entirely powered by renewable energy, primarily hydroelectric power. As a result, the carbon emissions from EVs in Norway are close to zero. This example demonstrates the potential for EVs to contribute to a cleaner, more sustainable future. Another common myth is that EV batteries cannot be recycled and therefore contribute to environmental waste. This misconception likely stems from concerns about the disposal of large lithium-ion batteries used in EVs. Contrary to popular belief, EV batteries are highly recyclable. In fact, the recycling rate for lead-acid batteries, which are used in traditional vehicles, is around 90% in most countries. EV batteries, which are primarily made of lithium-ion, have a similarly high recyclability potential. Companies like Redwood Materials and Lithium Cycle are pioneering advanced recycling techniques to recover valuable materials such as lithium, cobalt, and nickel from used EV batteries. These materials can then be reused in the production of new batteries, reducing the need for mining and conserving natural resources. Moreover, EV batteries are designed to last a long time. The lifespan of an EV battery can exceed the life of the vehicle itself, which is typically around 15 years or 150,000 miles. After their automotive life, these batteries can still be repurposed for other uses, such as energy storage for homes or businesses, before they eventually need to be recycled. Nissan, one of the leading manufacturers of electric vehicles, has established a comprehensive battery recycling program. The company's LEAF model, which is one of the first mass-market EVs, uses lithium-ion batteries that can be repurposed for energy storage after their automotive life. In Japan, Nissan has partnered with Sumitomo Corporation to create 4R Energy, a joint venture that focuses on reusing, reselling, refabricating, and recycling used EV batteries. This initiative not only extends the life of the batteries, but also supports the circular economy. Many potential EV buyers are concerned about the lifespan of the battery, fearing that it will degrade quickly and need to be replaced, much like the batteries in smartphones and laptops. While it is true that all batteries degrade over time, the rate of degradation in EV batteries is much slower than in consumer electronics. EV batteries are designed with advanced battery management systems that optimize charging and discharging processes to extend battery life. Unlike smartphone batteries, which are typically charged daily, EV batteries are charged less frequently depending on the driving habits of the owner. Furthermore, most EV manufacturers offer warranties that cover the battery for 8 or 10 years, or 100,000 to 150,000 miles, ensuring that the battery will retain a significant portion of its capacity during that time. For example, Tesla guarantees that its Model S and Model X batteries will retain at least 70% of their capacity over an 8-year period. 
EV batteries consist of hundreds or thousands of individual cells, each of which is carefully managed by the BMS to prevent overcharging, overheating, and deep discharging, factors that can accelerate battery degradation. By distributing the load evenly across all cells, the BMS ensures that the battery's performance remains consistent over time. Additionally, regenerative braking systems in EVs help recharge the battery while driving, further reducing the need for frequent charging. Range anxiety or the fear of running out of battery power before reaching a charging station is a significant concern for many people considering an EV. This myth suggests that EVs have a limited driving range or are not suitable for long-distance travel. Today's EVs are equipped with batteries that offer much longer ranges than earlier models. For instance, the Tesla Model 3 Long Range has an EPA-rated range of 358 miles on a single charge, while the Ford Mustang Mach-E Extended Range can travel up to 300 miles. These ranges are more than sufficient for most daily commutes, which average around 30 miles per day in the U.S. In addition to the improved range of modern EVs, the charging infrastructure is rapidly expanding. According to the International Energy Agency, the number of public EV charging points worldwide increased by 43% in 2020, with over 1.3 million public chargers. Governments and private companies are investing heavily in charging infrastructure to support the growing number of EVs on the road. For example, the Biden administration in the U.S. has set a goal of installing 500,000 public charging stations by 2030. For those concerned about long road trips, fast charging networks like Tesla's Supercharger Network and Electrify America offer convenient solutions. These stations can recharge an EV battery to 80% in as little as 30 minutes, allowing drivers to take a short break and continue their journey without significant delays. Additionally, many EVs come with built-in navigation systems that can play in routes based on the availability of charging stations, making long-distance travel more manageable. A common misconception is that electric vehicles are sluggish and lack the power and speed of traditional gasoline-powered cars. Electric vehicles are actually faster and more responsive than many of their gasoline-powered counterparts. This is because electric motors provide instant torque, which is the force that propels the vehicle forward. Unlike internal combustion engines, which need to build up power as the engine revs, electric motors deliver 100% of their torque from the moment you press the accelerator pedal, and this results in rapid acceleration in a smooth, quiet ride. For example, the Tesla Model S Plaid can accelerate from 0 to 60 miles per hour in just 1.99 seconds, making it one of the fastest production cars in the world. Even more affordable EVs like the Chevrolet Bolt and Nissan Leaf offer brisk acceleration that rivals or exceeds that of similarly priced gasoline cars. The performance capabilities of electric vehicles are not limited to everyday driving. The world of motorsports has embraced EVs with the introduction of Formula E, a racing series that features fully electric single-seater race cars. Formula E cars can reach speeds of up to 174 miles per hour and demonstrate the incredible performance of potential electric powertrains. One of the most widespread myths about EVs is the way they are prohibitively expensive and out of reach for average consumers. While it's true that some EVs have higher upfront costs compared to gasoline-powered vehicles, this doesn't tell the whole story. So let us know your views on today's video in the comments below, and don't forget to like, share, and subscribe.